Tonight, the Target 12 investigators are digging deeper into the safety of the intersection in front of what's left of the old Grist Mill Tavern. A tractor trailer crashed and hit a gas line there last week, sending the driver to the hospital and causing a fire that destroyed the 18th century landmark. The Pinpoint News Tracker takes you to Fall River Avenue in Seekonk, where you can see the curves leading up to the confusing three-way intersection. Target 12 investigator Walt Buteau is there now with a look at a report on the road that was just released today. The safety audit was underway long before the crash caused the fire that destroyed the building here. The tractor trailer tumbled onto its side after driving into one of the odd angles of the three-way intersection. The rig slid into a gas line and within hours the grist mill was destroyed. The audit shows there have been 49 accidents at this intersection from January of 2009 to the end of last year. And more than 60% were considered what the report called angle accidents. The audit cited safety issues related to the unique geometry of the intersection, including the horizontal curvature of the roadway and the overgrowth of vegetation. While it's unknown whether those issues contributed to this crash, the audit does recommend that the town and the state reconstruct the intersection with a traffic signal or roundabout. According to the audit, Seacock prefers the traffic signal, but there is one sentence in bold letters in what amounts to the only reference to the crash in the 43-page document. The town may wish to reconsider the roundabout option following the fire at the old grist mill. Meanwhile, the investigation continues into the exact cause of the crash. With the Target 12 investigators in Seekonk, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.